so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi! And I have a great idea what we could draw today. Let's draw an animal, really big animal. It's the third largest living land animal today. Yeah, it's a hippopotamus. Oh, what a silly name, hippopotamus. You can just call him a hippo. <laughs> All right, let's see. Hippos are really big. So let's draw it an oval. Yeah, for its mouth area. Ooh, and then half circle for its head. Ooh, and let, let's draw two small circles for the eyes. Ooh, and then two little cute ears. There we go. Ooh, and two dots for the nose. Little smiley face and a really big body because they're so big. Ooh, and then there's one back leg and another back leg. Kind of looks like a rectangle. Big belly and then two rectangles up here for the legs. But you can't forget about the tail. There we go. There we go. Hey, hippo. <laughs> well, if you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. Hey, it's me, Blippi. And today, I'm at the Phoenix Zoo in Phoenix, Arizona. Hey, I think you and I should learn about some animals today. Let's go. Do you see that? That is a howler monkey. Yeah, do you see it? Yeah, right there. That is Bilbo, named after Bilbo Baggins. <laughs> That's funny. Let's act like monkeys together. That's Lulu the rhinoceros. And Lulu is 21 years old. <laughs> yeah, Lulu, party! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> That's a toucan. Did you see its big beak? Kind of looks like a banana. Let's check out another animal. Oh, whoa, look at this. Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, this is a tiger. Whoa, hello, kitty. <laughs> whoa, come over here. Turn around. Whoa. This is where the tigers live. Hey, and look at who it is over here. Looks like we're getting ready to do some training. See that? The tiger is doing exactly what he's saying. It looks like they're having so much fun. Target. Target. Ooh, that was really cool. Did you see that? Hey, will you tell us why we just did that? Yeah, so uh, we train our animals so that um, they have the opportunity to make things easier for them and the staff. Ooh. So we don't train our animals to do tricks, um, we do what we call behaviors. So for example, when I was having Jay target his nose to the end of this pole, um, it allowed me to move him to different positions so I could see different parts of his body. Um, having him stand up is not only impressive to see how big a tiger is, 
um, but it gives me the chance to see his underside because just like us, they can get injuries like cuts and bruises. So it lets me check up on his body to make sure he's still feeling good. Ooh, well thank you so much for showing me what you just showed me. You're very welcome. All right, see you later. Thanks. <laughs> let's go see some more stuff. Do you see that animal? It's another cat. This is a jaguar. Whoa. I have a pail of carrots and some tongs. And we just got told we need to feed the next animal. Come on. Whoa. Hey, check it out. These are cables that you have to be on this side of them. But we just got permission to head inside so we can feed the animals. Let's go. Okay, this is a short barrier. Interesting. That wasn't too hard to get in. Oh, I see the animal, look. Let's go through the trees. Whoa, hey look, look at the animal. We get a fee, check it out. Whoa, do you know what kind of animal this is? This is a tortoise. Let's feed the tortoises, yeah. Check this out, this is a carrot and I'm using tongs because tortoises have really strong jaws. It might bite my finger off. Here you go. Whoa, oh, whoops, it slipped. <laughs> Here you go. Whoa, okay, would you like a little bit more? Yeah, okay, here you go. Oh, there you go. Whoa. This tortoise is about 550 pounds. Whoa, that is really heavy. Hey, and guess how old he is? Oh, he's 66 years old. Whoa, that's really old. Oh, hello. Hey, check this out. I'll pet this tortoise's head. Hello, how are you? Whoa, whoa, look, the tortoise is off the ground. Do you see that? Because that allows for all the bugs and everything to get away from its underneath area. Whoa, okay, let's go get some more carrots. Whoa, hello, how are you doing? Are you having a good day? Ooh, check it out. See this tortoise? This tortoise is a Galapagos tortoise, and it's a female. Oh, oh, there you go. Oh, and here comes the male. Whoa, do you see how big he is? Oh, I'm getting trapped. Okay, I'm gonna loop right around here. See how this one's a little smaller? And this one is bigger? Whoa! This is a female, and this is a male. Whoa! Hey, do you two like each other? Yeah, you two look like your friends. <laughs> oh, would you like some more? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Good job. Oh, you dropped it. <laughs> hey, come a little closer. Okay, here you go. All right. Open wide, here comes the carrot. Whoa! There you go. Is that yummy? Hey, tortoises like carrots, just like how I do. And carrots are nice and healthy. There you go. Whoa! You have a big mouth. 
Whoa, look, I'm giving this tortoise a scratch. See, how does that feel? Does that feel good? Yeah. Do you see how the tortoise is standing on its legs really high in the air? In the wild, they do this because a lot of times they have bugs underneath them. And this allows for the finches, which are birds, go, go, to fly underneath there and then eat all of the bugs underneath this tortoise. Yeah, but for now, he's standing on his legs because this feels really good. It's kind of like when a grown-up gives you a back scratch. Yeah, I like when my mom gives me a back scratch. Yeah, how does this feel? You like that? Yeah. <laughs> okay, my turn. Okay, my turn. I'm ready. I'm ready. Ooh, check this out. This is an armadillo. Okay, here you go. Run free. Oh, look. An armadillo is one of the ambassador animals at the zoo. That means it's an animal that you can meet face to face. Whoa, hey, what are you doing? You want a treat? Armadillos love mealworms. Here you go. Uh-oh. Hey, come right over here. There you go. Look, doesn't this armadillo look hard? Yeah, it is kind of hard. And it's not a shell. It's bone inside the armadillo's skin. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Ooh, this is Princess Buttercup. Ooh, all right. Here you go. Here you go, Princess Buttercup. Ooh, look at Princess Buttercup's pretty little nails. Whoa. Okay, run free. Whoa! Look at this animal. What kind of animal is this? This is an Indian crested porcupine. Whoa! Look at all of its spines. Are those spines? The big ones are just to make her look scary, but the dangerous ones are down by her tail. Oh, okay, down there, whoa. And what is she doing right now? We're just enjoying some snacks. Ooh. She likes a lot of plants, so we've got her some biscuits, some yam, and some apple today. Ooh, that sounds pretty tasty, actually. Ooh, let's take a closer look at the porcupine. You don't want to touch this animal on its tail. <laughs> Whoa! Check this out! This next area is really cool. Whoa, do you hear that? All these things are working really hard to keep this next area exactly like how the ocean is. Come here! Whoa, look at it! Whoa, there's so many filters and, and other things. It's so cool. Okay, come over here. Let me show you what it's doing. Yeah, this is Stingray Bay and they're training the stingrays to do some pretty cool tricks. If you come to this zoo, you can use a flat, gentle hand and touch the stingrays on their back. But they're letting me go inside. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, first, I need to take off my shoes. One shoe. Whoa, two shoes. Okay, let's put those there. Can't forget about the socks because I'm gonna put these on. Whoa, they're like water socks or water shoes. Okay, let's put them on. All right, okay, okay, <laughs> I'm ready, here we go. 
You have to be nice and smooth and slow so you don't scare them. Oh, oh the water's nice and cold. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. What's your name? My name is Mary and this is Kelsey. We work here at the Phoenix Zoo. Ooh, so what are you doing right now? So right now we're giving breakfast to our stingrays and we're checking them to make sure everybody's healthy and happy this morning. Ooh, that sounds like fun. Can I help? Sure. Would you like to feed some? Ooh, yeah. Let's feed the stingrays. Okay. So Look at them. They have shrimp and smelt. So you can take a couple and you can put it in your hand. Okay. Check out the food. Whoa! It looks so tasty. Okay, I put it in my hand. You're gonna hold it like an ice cream cone. Okay. Ooh, I like ice cream. <laughs> okay, just like that. Put it nice and deep into the water. They're gonna swim over your hand and they're gonna suck it out of your hand like a vacuum. Okay. Okay, here you go. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Look at that one. So you've got a uh, blue spotted ribbon tail sitting on your feet. Oh. <laughs> okay. Do I go deeper in the water? Let's see what we can do. Oh, Come there you on, go. guys. Oh, I did it! Look, it's gone. <laughs> it sucked it right out of my hand. Can I do it again? You can. Yeah. Oh. oh, thank you. <laughs> they suck the food right out of my hand. It's kind of like, have you ever put a vacuum on your hand and then the vacuum sucks on your hand? That's kind of how it feels like when it's sucking the food out of your hand. Whoa! <laughs> that one just swam through my legs. <laughs> Whoa! Look at them. So they're getting used to you now. So they can yeah. feel who you are by your heartbeat. Okay. They're understanding that you're not going to hurt them. And so they're coming closer and closer. Whoa. As they're getting more and more comfortable with you. Yeah. Look at them. Hello. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> that scared me. What happened there? They just got a little bit excited. Okay. Excited, not scared? Yeah. Okay. Because I kind of got scared. <laughs> But that's okay. They kind of seem really gentle. Oh! Whoa! Whoa! There they go again! <laughs> Look at how wet I'm getting! <laughs> Alright, let's feed some more. Hello! Look at all these stingrays! Whoa! <laughs> Alright, bye bye, stingrays! Ooh, now we're gonna take a camel ride. <laughs> Have fun, Flippy. Thank you. Look, this is the top of the camel. See the hump? I'm gonna sit on top of it. Whoa! Now I'm on top of a camel. Okay, here we go. Check it out. Wee! Whoa! Hey! Look! I'm on the hump of the camel! Whoa! This is a nice camel! This is a dromedary camel! It's really high up here! Whoa! <laughs> I'm having so much fun! <laughs> Wee! Hello! Whoa! Check it out! See the hump of the camel? They store fat in here. And they can actually go about seven months without eating food. Or three to four weeks without drinking any water. That's pretty impressive, huh? Whoa! Whee! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! It has some pretty long legs, huh? It has four legs. 
and you and I have two. Cool. All right, this is pretty fun. Awesome, thank you very much. Yeah, you're welcome. All right, okay, let's go see some more animals. Ooh, now we're behind the scenes of the Native Arizona exhibit. Ooh, check it out. Look, some tools. Hey, what does this look like? Kind of looks like a golf club. <laughs> but actually, see how it has a hook? It's used to handle certain types of reptiles, like a snake. Okay, but I'm not gonna use that because I'm not a trained professional. Ooh, check it out. Wow, some aquariums. <laughs> the fish are on the other side. We're behind the scenes. Whoa, look at this room. Whoa, this is a box. And this is where a snake lives. Let's read what kind it is. Rattlesnake. Venomous? <gasps> okay, I don't think I should handle that one. Cause like I said, I'm not a trained professional. <laughs> Let's find a snake that I can handle. Whoa, this room's pretty cool. Whoa, there's so many cages right here. Whoa, what are these? These are snake sheds. Wow, every snake sheds its skin every couple months. Look at that. And they're all in one piece. Look, doesn't that look like a snake? Yeah, that's pretty cool, huh? Okay, okay, I'll keep these right here. Okay, yeah, this one looks like a good snake to handle. I'm handling a snake. Whoa, and look at the color of this snake. It's orange and white and black. Whoa. I used to be afraid of snakes when I was a child, but now I'm not. But some snakes you definitely don't want to hold. So if you ever see a snake in the wild, just to be safe, you probably shouldn't try and hold it like this. Okay, whoa. Look, are you having fun, snake? Whee. Hello. Hey. Whoa, look at it. Whoa! It's so intrigued with the camera. Whoa. Whoa. This is awesome. We're behind the scenes of another reptile area. Whoa, there's so many cool tanks in here with so many unique creatures. Whoa! <laughs> hey! Whoa, look right here. Oh, hey! There's someone over here. Come here! Whoa! Hey, what are you doing? Just getting ready to check out one of our horned lizards. Did you want to hold him? Yeah! A horned lizard? That's cool. Okay. Okay, thank you. Whoa, look! This is a horned lizard. Check out its horns. Wow. <laughs> he's so cute. Oh, and he's just hanging out. <laughs> okay, well, thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay, there you go. That was awesome. Good job. Let's go. Hello, hello. <laughs> Whoa. Oh. A lion? Ooh, an elephant. <laughs> Whoa, look! <laughs> this 
is a gorilla. <laughs> And some snakes? Yeah, I gotta hold a snake. Whoa. Isn't that cool? Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, there's so many cool things in here. Okay, follow me. Ooh, there's even a dinosaur. A Tyrannosaurus Rex. Interesting. Well, hey, that was so much fun learning about animals with you at the zoo. This is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi. Good job. All right. See you later. <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi Bunny. <laughs> just kidding. It's me, Blippi. And I was just acting like a bunny. Hey. Why don't we draw a bunny together today? Wow, I love bunnies. They are so cute and fluffy. All right, let's draw the head. There we go, nice circle. Ooh, and let's draw the ears. They have big, tall ears. Yeah, there we go. Oh, and now let's draw the face. Two circles for the eyes. Ooh, a circle for the nose. Oh, and then down here, yeah, let's draw the buck teeth. There we go. And speaking of buck, yeah, an adult male is called a buck. Yeah, an adult female bunny is called a doe, and a child is called a kit. Isn't that cute? Whoa. All right, let's draw on the eyes. There we go. Can't forget about the big whiskers. There we go. <laughs> so cute. Well, if you want to keep drawing with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I, Blippi. See you again, bye-bye. We are at Point Defiance Zoo and Aquarium in Tacoma, Washington. And today, we are gonna see some awesome animals. Let's go. Got my members card. All right, okay, come on. Gonna be so much fun. Yay! Here we go! Hey, this is Cindy. And what do we have here, Cindy? That is a Pacific herring. Ooh, and we are about to go feed some penguins. Did you see how we walked up really low? You gotta stay low so then they don't get scared. are the color white. That polar bear, yeah, his name is Boris. And he's 31 years old. Boris was rescued from a circus, a traveling circus in Mexico. And it's really important to have ice so polar bears can 
hunt off of and get, get seals in the Arctic. So we should be really aware of what we do to our planet so polar bears can have a lot of ice. That is? Yeah, that's a tiger. Meow. That's a really big kitty cat. <laughs> that's actually a Sumatran tiger to be exact. And there's only about 300 left on this entire planet in the wild. So here at Point Defiance Zoo and Aquarium, this tiger is an ambassador. So this is Sarah. Hi. And Sarah, what do we have here? This is Gonzo, and he is a tree climbing anteater. And here at Point Defiance Zoo and Aquarium, we're training him to be part of our Wild Wonders Outdoor Theater show that's Ooh. brand new this summer. Hey, Gonzo. So what are we gonna? Yeah, what are we gonna be doing right now? You're gonna help me train Gonzo to eat vanilla yogurt Ooh. from a tube. Okay. So, so this is something that he will love to do. Hold okay. that up, Hold right it. up to his little nose. Okay, here I go. And he's gonna slurp that vanilla yogurt Ooh. right out with his super long tongue. Whoa. Check that out. Look at Gonzo's tongue, it's so long. Now, of course, in the wild, Gonzo would not eat vanilla yogurt. He would eat ants. And he has really big claws that he can use to break open ants' nests and termite bounds, and then he'd use his long tongue to slurp those bugs right up. Ooh, yum, that looks pretty tasty. Yeah, so Gonzo has been around people his whole entire life, and when he first came here, we started training him to be part of the show. So that's why he's so comfortable hanging out hey. with us out here. Yeah, he seems like a really great and fun anteater. <laughs> What are you doing? I'm making some diets for the meerkats. Some meerkats? I love meerkats. What else are you going to do today? Well, you know what? I was going to do some enrichment. Do you want to help me? Yeah. Excellent. Let's so, go over to the exhibit. OK. And what's enrichment? Enrichment is giving our animals choices, things to do, things to play with, kind of like kids on a playground. Ooh, that sounds fun. I like playing. So let's give them some choices. Okay. Let's put these wiffle balls okay. in the blue pool on exhibit. OK. All right. Wiffle balls, blue pool. Got it. this place. This is the exhibit from the habitat of where meerkats play. Whoa. <laughs> okay, anywho, back to it. Wiffle balls, blue pool. Right. Okay, let's put these in here. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun to see the meerkats play with these wiffle balls that we're putting in here. Okay, and the second one. Okay, here we go. Let's see what else she wants us to do. Hey, okay, here you go. Thank you. What else do you have well, for I've us? Well, I've got some more fun toys. Let's put these out on the exhibit as okay. well. Okay, where should I put these? Wherever you want. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. Where should we put these? Here, come on. Okay, let's see. Oh, let's see. I think the yellow one should go. Oh, do you see this? Let's put it right there. <laughs> And then, ooh, come back here. Let's put the pink one right, let's do this one right here actually, right next to the yellow one. And the really big red one, let's put over here. Here, I'll meet you over that way. <laughs> it's like I'm a meerkat, watch. 
Okay, let's see what else we need to do. Come on. Let's okay. take the fun up a notch. Let's add some food enrichment to the toy enrichment. Ooh. Here's some mealworms. It's like chocolate for meerkats. Ooh, yum. Look at this. Ooh, yum. So where would you like me to put this? You know what? Let's sprinkle some in the wiffle balls. Okay. And if you want to put some elsewhere in the exhibit, you can do that too. Okay. It's kind of like a search and find. Because we'll put some right here, and then we'll hide some for them to find it, okay? So, spread out the wiffle balls, and let's sprinkle some on top of the wiffle balls. Whee! <laughs> Ooh, this is gonna be fun! Okay. Okay. Okay, there's a little bit more. Let's put some right on this ledge. Mmm, those look tasty. Okay, let's just put the rest in here. All right. I think we're ready. Are we all done? Great job, Blippi. Let's let them out. Okay. is a dromedary camel, and his name is Winchester. <laughs> dromedary camels are found in Africa, and if you're three years old and 36 inches or taller, you can ride camels at Point Defiance Zoo. They're really soft. Wow. We are in the Marine Discovery Center. In this place, has amazing sea creatures and we can actually touch them. See? You can touch but with only one finger, okay? Oh, look at these right here. Oh, that was scary. <laughs> that scared me. Ooh, and look, here's a snail. Hello. Hi, little guy. And hey, little girl. Hello. Whoa. Oh, oh, look at this over here. One finger. Woo! Did you see it? it? Like attached to my finger. Here, get a really good close. Oh, look at how big this one is. <gasps> okay, you ready? Woo! Wee! Oh, it attaches to your finger and it's so soft. Oh, last but not least, starfish. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! They're really hard. It's so cool. And these are actually alive. They're real sea creatures. <laughs> they don't move very much, but they do move. Really slow. I really love the Marine Discovery Lab. <laughs> Carousel, come on! Hey, horsey! This is gonna be so much fun! See? It's a carousel! And right here, this is the instrument panel that turns on the carousel. And I got the key! <laughs> okay, let's put in the key right there. <laughs> and... one of those today. A zebra, did you see the zebra? Oh, a pig. Ooh, tiger. Ooh, an anteater. Okay. Now I think it's time for us to ride the carousel. Come on. But first we need to pick our favorite animal. Gotta wait for it to stop. Come this way. Wait, 
the zebra. Hmm, I don't know if I want to ride the zebra. Let's see what else. A horse, a polar bear. So much fun. Okay, this animal, yeah, is a poison dart frog. And I am going to ride this animal. Gotta buckle up first. And once I'm all buckled up, oh, gotta loosen that up a little bit. Oh, all right. I am ready to ride. Here we go. See, we spin around and around as well as go up and down. Whoa! Hey, horsey! Whoa! Look! This poison dart frog is the color yellow. to draw. I do too. Let's draw an animal together. Okay, you can guess what animal it is. It's really tall, has a really long neck. Yeah, and they live in Africa. <gasps> yeah, a giraffe. Let's draw a giraffe together. First, let's draw the head. Ooh, there we go. Two little ears, just like that. Oh, and then on top, they have these things called Aussie cones. Yeah, they kind of look like horns, but they're a lot cuter. <laughs> All right, two small eyes. There we go. And then two nostrils and then a smiley face. Nose, mouth, and eyes. All right, now let's draw the really long neck. Yeah, there we go. And then there's the body. Oh, and then it has four legs. <laughs> there we go. And then the feet. Perfect. And the tail. Whoa. Oh, and you can't forget about all the spots, just like that. Oh, there we go. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> Wasn't this so much fun drawing a draft together? Yeah. If you want to draw more with me, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Blippi. All right, see you again. Bye-bye. And today we're at Odyssey in Scottsdale, Arizona. Come on. This is gonna be awesome. I think today you and I should learn about some animals. Whoa, look at this place. Whoa, those are kind of like raindrops. Hello. Okay, let's go over here. Whoa, we're almost to the top! Whoa! Yeah, let's go! This is gonna be so much fun! Oh, did you see that? I just used two fingers on the back of the head in the back of this Russian sturgeon. Oh, it looks like he liked it. Whoa, it feels so cool. It's hard, but it also has kind of a layer of a slippery sludge on it. <laughs> it helps keep all the parasites away. Oh, here's another one. That is awesome! <laughs> Whoa, did you see that? I just touched the stingray nice and gently with my two fingers on its back. Whoa, okay, let's, uh, let's touch another one. Oh, here's one right over here. Oh, oh hey! Whoa, <laughs> that's silly. Ooh. 
come over here. Whoa. There's so many of them. Whoa. Look at that one. It's just resting on the ground. That's a different kind. Huh. Oh, here comes one. I'll describe what it feels like. It kind of feels, oh, here's one more. Whoa, yeah, I really know what it feels like now. It feels like a wet gummy bear. <laughs> so slippery and soft at the same time, but firm as well. Wow, <laughs> this is fun. Blippi, what are you doing? Oh, just sitting here looking at my favorite fish, the paddlefish. Ooh, paddlefish? That's pretty cool. It is. Well, see you later. Hope oh, see you later, Blippi. Whoa, this is pretty cool being behind the scenes of the aquarium. Hello. <laughs> this is awesome. Whoa. Oh, hey. So many cool workers here. Whoa, look at this. We're on top of an aquarium! Whoa, look at all that water and those fish down there! Whoa, okay, follow me. Whoa, look at this room! Whoa, there's so much scuba gear in here, tanks, wetsuits. Whoa, okay, we need to take this fish to the sharks. I bet they're really hungry. Come on! Whoa! Wow. Okay. Whoa, look at this. Whoever drew that is a good artist. It shows the different parts of a shark. Yeah, like the gills. Oh. Whoa, look. All right, we did it. Here you go. Hi, thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. What's your name? My name's Danny. Oh, this is Danny, and what are you doing here? So we're here with actually feeding our big sharks right now. Whoa, look, I see a fish down there, look. Whoa, so what, why is she holding a fish on a pole? So that's how we get the food down to our sharks. If they're all pretty low in the water column, she needs to be able to have a really long tool to get the food down to their mouth. Okay, so they hold the pole, which has a fish on the end, and then the sharks come up and have some supper. <laughs> Ooh, this looks like fun. Whoa, those fish look big. How big is that fish that she's feeding the sharks? It's about this big. It's called a blue fish because that has a kind of blue tint to it. Okay, that's a blue fish. That's about this big. So what kind of fish did I bring up? So you brought up some herring. Big fish in here. Okay. And then some caitlin, which is the little fish in here. Okay. Huh. Interesting. Oh. Hey, well, this is pretty cool seeing someone else do it, but hey, can I feed some sharks? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. okay. Just make sure you have your gloves on because the fish can be kind of stinky. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's put the gloves on so then my hands don't smell like fish for weeks. <laughs> Okay, all right, I got my gloves on. Uh, oh, there we go. One glove, two gloves. All right, and now what do I do? So we'll just take this fish bucket that you brought up from our kitchen and we'll head over here. Okay, all right. Okay, all right. We'll head over to our feeding platform. Okay. And as soon as you walk up, the fish will be all ready for us. Okay. Whoa. I'm on the platform. Whoa, look, there's no barriers between me and the fish. Okay, I'm just gonna jump in. Oh, no. <laughs> just kidding. All right, here we go. Can I throw one at a time? Yeah, whatever you want. Either one at a time or all of it at once. All right, enjoy this. Whoa, look at him go. They're really enjoying this. Oh, look at all of them. They're swarming to the 
top. Because they know that I'm throwing all this yummy food to them. Alright. Whee! Whoa! Here you go, bitch. Is it that tasty? Is that tasty fish or is that tasty? <laughs> okay, just a little left. Here we go. Whoa, that was so much fun. <laughs> Good job. Whoa. Ooh, she's feeding a turtle. Come on. Whoa, so many cool things up here. Whoa. Okay, let's go over here. <laughs> oh, okay, what are you doing? I am feeding Greta, our green sea turtle. Ooh, she's feeding Greta? That's a nice name. And this is Greta. Do you see Greta? Hey, Greta. Hey. Ooh, what does Greta like to eat? Greta loves lettuce. Also enjoys cucumbers, bell peppers, and even sometimes carrots. Ooh, lettuce, bell peppers, cucumbers, and carrots? Sounds like Greta's really healthy. <laughs> Can I try feeding Greta? Yeah. Hey. Alright. How do I do it? Just a little bit? Yeah, just a little bit, but holy if you just pop them right. Hey. There you go, Greta. Whoa. Hey, what are you doing? What are you trying to? Should I throw another? Oh, here you sure. go. Sure, there we go. Sometimes you get them from Oh, okay. Alright. Ooh, Greta's hungry. Here you go, Greta. Yum! Here you go. Oh, Greta is really big. Do you know how much Greta weighs? She is a little bit over 100 pounds. Oh, wow. A hundred pounds. Wow. Oh, here you go. <laughs> okay, let's do a big piece. Let's watch Greta eat a whole piece. Here you go. Oh, it's right there. Yeah. Whoa. Hey. <laughs> Hello. Whoa. That's a big piece of lettuce. some animals. I think we should use this restroom and wash our hands. Let's go. Okay, welcome to the bathroom. Whoa, look. Whoa, look. This restroom is underwater. And this restroom actually won the best restroom in America. Whoa, you can wash your hands right here. And look at shark. Sharks and fish. Whoa, this is awesome. <laughs> Pretty cool. All right, I wash my hands. Now I'll go dry them. You enjoy the view. Okay, let's go down the escalator to the deep ocean. <laughs> Come on. Like we're underwater. Look this way. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. I present to you the Deep Ocean Exhibit. Hello! Hey! 
Okay, so this is a sea lion. Whoa. There's another one over here. Oh, it's so big. <laughs> so cool. Oh, look, look, look. Oh, hello. <laughs> Whoa. And there's actually a seal in here as well. Let's go try and find it. Oh, let's see. Oh, here it is. Hello. See that right here? This is a seal. Hi. So there's three sea lions in here and one seal. And the easiest way to tell the difference is this. I'll show you. So if you're a sea lion, you use your front flippers to, to basically walk like this. <laughs> but seals don't do that. Seals. Oh, hello. Oh, oh you're curious, huh? <laughs> so curious. Whoa. So that's a sea lion. Mm -hmm. So it walks with its flippers. Hello, 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 hello. They're actually really smart animals. See how it's following me? I'll try and change directions. Whoa! <laughs> okay, and seals, they don't walk like that, you know? This is a sea lion. Sea lion. And a seal, they don't have that much power right here and it's kind of short and stubby. So this is what they do. So they just kind of waddle. That's silly. Wow, what magnificent creatures. Check them out a little bit more. We're behind the scenes at the aquarium and we're gonna meet some penguins. Come on! Okay, let's walk nice and slow and we'll be very quiet as well. Ooh. Hey, who are you? Hutch. Ooh, this is Hutch. Hey, okay, what do you do here? I work with the penguins and reptiles. Ooh, the penguins and the reptiles. Oh, do you see the penguins back there? Oh, hello. Are these your only two penguins here? Oh, no, we have more friends that are coming. Would you like to grab a toy? We're actually going to play with them. Sure. Okay, let's grab a toy and let's see some more penguins. Look over there. They also can see colors really well and have rods and cones in their eyes, just like we do. Okay. They're kind of, although they're birds, they're kind of acting like kitty cats, huh? Just a little bit. They do like to play with a lot of different types of toys. And, just like kitty cats, they tell us when they want to be touched. Okay. Huh, interesting. It's pretty cool. Hey, get a closer look. Oh, bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> penguins are so silly. So where are these penguins from? These penguins are from South Africa. Okay. And we have 32 of them here at the aquarium. Wow, 32 penguins here. And these are from South Africa? Yes. <laughs> Not Antarctica? Not Antarctica. They're actually one of several species of penguins that prefer the warm climate. Oh, okay. That's pretty cool. Interesting. Warm climate and penguins. I guess you learn something every day. <laughs> hey, let's take a seat right over here. And then Hutch is gonna bring a penguin over. <laughs> I'm so excited. I get to touch a penguin. Ooh, hello. <laughs> okay, so 
So I'm gonna touch the penguin with two fingers gently on its back. Hey, are you ready? so soft. Did you know penguins have 70 feathers per square inch? Yeah, they're really small and really dense. Can I touch the gam punch? Yes, you can. Okay. Does that feel good? You like that? She's showing off for you. What does that mean when she shakes her head? So that means she's really happy, uh, and you might be her new boyfriend. <laughs> I hope she doesn't want to kiss. <laughs> oh, hello! This is a little blue penguin. It's pretty small. Whoa! And this board has the sizes of different penguins. Oh! Like the penguin I met today, an African penguin. Whoa, and they just keep getting bigger. Whoa, whoa, look how big they're getting. Whoa, look how big this penguin is. Whoa, four feet tall, 1.3 meters high? Jeez, look how big it is. Oh, whoa, that's a really big penguin. A toucan! <laughs> Do you see its beak? <laughs> kind of looks like the shape of a banana. A really colorful banana. <laughs> There's another bird over here. Come on! Whoa! Hello! <laughs> a colorful parrot! Hey! How are you? <laughs> Whoa! Looks like it's yellow, blue, and on its head, it's green! <laughs> hey! Hey, there's another animal right over here I want to show you. Come on! Whoa, look! Look at this animal! It's moving really slow. <laughs> Do you know what animal this is? Yeah, this is a sloth. Let's act like a sloth together. Hello! How are you? Ah! 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 <laughs> That's funny. All right, hello. These are otters, and they're so cute. Look at them go underwater. Whoa. I bet they can hold their breath for a really long time. Whoa. They're so fast. Whoa. <laughs> they kind of look like water cats, <laughs> but they're not kitty cats. <laughs> Whoa. Hi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh, another one. Whoa! <laughs> cool! Whoa! That was so much fun learning about all these creatures at Odyssey in Scottsdale, Arizona with you. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. Blippi, good job. All right, see you soon. <laughs> Come on everyone, let's make learning fun. So much to learn about, it'll make you wanna shout. Blippi!